traveled from Paris to Germany and arrived in Heidelberg on February 3, 1886. He spoke with Dr. Otto Becker, a German ophthalmologist. Rizzo also works at University Eye Hospital under Dr. Becker's supervision. Then, on February 1, 1886, Rizal arrived in Berlin. He was captivated by Berlin's unique atmosphere and lack of social prejudice. At that time, he met his favorite author, Dr. Fyodor Jogger, a great artist and author of Travel in the Full East. Rizal also met the father of modern pathologist, Dr. Rodolf Virchow. Rizal stayed in Berlin to further his knowledge of ophthalmology improve his science and language studies, associate with world-famous German scientists and scholars, and finally publish his novel Nole Mitangere. Rizal's visit in Japan, the land of cherry blossom, Rizal left Hong Kong on board of the Oceanic and American steamer on his way to Japan. Rizal arrived in Yokohama, Japan on February 28, 1888 and registered at Grand Hotel. February 29, 1888, he proceeded to Tokyo and stayed in Tokyo, Tokyo Hotel for the six days. He visited Juan Perez Caballero, secretary of Spanish legation, Caballero inviting him to stay in the Spanish legation. He accepted it. He met Aosei San, a samurai's daughter at 23 years old, a woman of beauty, charm, modesty, and intelligence. Aosei San was Rizal's girlfriend and more to that, she was his guide, interpreter, and tutor. Rizal and Aosei San are both theater addicts. He met Te Techo Suero, a fighting Japanese journalist, novelist, champion of human rights. Techo Suero became a member of the Japanese Imperial Diet, wrote two novels. On April 13, 1888, Rizal boarded the Belgic and English steamer at Yokohama bound for the United States. He left Japan with a heavy heart for a he knew that he will never see this beautiful land again so as his beloved soul Osei-san. The second ship of Jose Rizal to abroad is in Hong Kong in February 3, 1888. He arrived on a vessel named Zafiro. The vessel arrived in Amoy Siam in China, but Rizal did not land because of his frail health, the city's rainy weather, and they reported that the city was dirty. While he was in Hong Kong, he met Jose Maria Basa and Balpino Maurico and Maurico Riarte, who were former exiles from the Philippines because of his events in 1972. He also met Zain Sadiveranda, former secretary of Governor Terrero that spied Rizal while he was in Hong Kong. Rizal also visited neighboring Macau where he received from February 18 to 20. Rizal studied the Chinese way of life including the Chinese New Year, the Chinese theaters, the Marathon Laureate Party, the Riches Order in Hong Kong, the cemeteries in Hong Kong. In February 22, 1888, Rizal left Hong Kong on board with Oshai. Rizal arrived at Port Said. Egypt in July 8, 1887, en route through the Suez Canal, Rizal got off at the Red Sea Terminal, and was amazed by the impressive moonlight scenery in Suez, and was engrossed with the multicultural people and language of the place. Why is Suez Canal important to Rizal? Well, my dear classmates, the opening of the Suez Canal brought the Philippines closer to Spain and Rizal's generation made the most out of it. It should be said that it was a brilliant generation, one known in Philippine history as the Illustrado Generation. The Suez Canal is a man-made waterway connecting the Mediterranean Sea to the Indian Ocean via the Red Sea. It enables a more direct route for shipping between Europe and Asia, effectively allowing for passage from the North Atlantic to the Indian Ocean with it, having to circumnavigate the African continent. Jose Rizal's first trip abroad, year 1882 to 1887, Philippines, May 3, 1882, Rizal left the Philippines for the first time. He boarded Salta Flora using a passport to Jose Mercado, which was procured for him by his uncle and brother Miguel. His first trip abroad was back to Spain. Singapore, May 9, 1882, the first of all of Rizal was made to Spain. Rizal wanted to go to the to the country in his trip to Spain. Toronto, May 18, 1882, it was Rizal's journey to Colombo, Sri Lanka, that was important for him to improve his knowledge of the French language, while he on board French ship Egypt, June 2, 1882, he arrived at the Swiss Canal en route to Marseilles. Italy, June 11, 1882, he arrived at the city of Naples, Italy for one hour, and this was the first European ground he set foot on. France, June 12 to 15, 1882, 
The boat anchored at Marseilles, France, and he boarded at the Noel's Hotel. Spain, June 16, 1882. Rizal arrived at Barcelona, Spain, and boarded in the Funda de España, September 2, 1882. He left Barcelona for Madrid to pursue his medical studies in the Universidad Central de Madrid. He also took courses in philosophy and letters and took French, German, and English lessons from private tutors.